Hundreds of thousands of tourists, and for one couple this morning, it was the perfect scene to tie the knot. But they didn't do it on the field, they waited until they were up above Albuquerque. Here's News 13, Stephanie Chavez. Jessica, this morning a bride and groom said I do floating 2,000 feet above the city. A wedding they say was a dream come true. This morning, Kristen Yent and Angelo Medina Perez vowed to spend the rest of their lives together. But instead of wedding bells, the soon to be newlyweds who road tripped here from New Orleans were surrounded by the sound of propane and fire filling a hot air balloon. Oh, the marriage is happening when we go up in the air with our balloon. Riding in a balloon has been on Kristen's bucket list for years. I said, hey, if you're really determined to go, then we're going to go. But we're going to get married and get two birds and one stone right yeah. there. But they're not the only couple with the idea. Their pilot has seen three weddings and a proposal since Fiesta started on Saturday. Ballooning is a very romantic sport, if you think about it. The adventurous couple says their untraditional wedding proves they're brave. We want to be brave. We want to do the things that maybe other couples aren't willing to do yeah. and shine in the way that others aren't willing to do for the name of Jesus, of course. Their bravery paid off when the wind subsided and their balloon floated off above the Duke City. So how do you perform a wedding on a noisy balloon? The Colorado pilot says he waits to fire up the burners until each sentence is complete. Jessica, back to you. All right, thank you, Stephanie. The newlyweds say they'll be having a reception with their families when they get back home to Louisiana.